Hi, to use Edge Panel on your Samsung Galaxy S25, as a first step, let's enable it. For that, we need to open Settings. From here, find and select Display tab, and then scroll a bit down more, and you'll find Edge Panels. So let's tap on this section itself. And now, as you can see, it's turned off, so Panels and Handle are unavailable. We need to turn it on by tapping on the switcher. And now you should see this line on the right edge of your phone. So, how to use it? Firstly, we can go in Panels and choose what we want to see and find on in our Edge panel. For example, if you want to easily reach No tab, you can pick Apps, tap on Edit, and make sure that Notes is added to the Edge panel. You can add something else, for example, Google Chrome, just by tapping it, and this is how it will look now. You can also remove something by tapping this minus. Also, you can easily reach your contacts just by adding people to the Edge panel. Tap on Edit and tap on Select Contacts. Choose Contact, tap Done, and this is how it will look. You can also add tools. So here you'll find compass, ruler, and so on. You can add tasks. You can add weather, clipboard, and reminder. Let's go back here. And in Handle, we can customize our Edge panel. So you can pick position either on the right side or on the left side. Also, you can lock this Handle position. You can change its color. So now it is red, as you can see. So this small line is Edge panel. You can make it any different color from the list. You can also set white so it would be almost invisible. You can tap here and manually choose color. After that, you can adjust its transparency. So this is low transparency. It would be more visible. This is high transparency. It would be more invisible. You can change its size. This is the smallest option right here. And this is the largest option. Let me just make transparency low so you could see it better. And also, you can change width here, the last setting. You can make it thick or you can make it thin. And now let's test it. So I'm going to go back to my home screen. And to find our apps or people, we need to swipe left from this edge panel. And you'll see this list of apps. You can tap on many dots and check all of your apps here. You can also edit this list by tapping pen icon. And now, if you want to find your contacts or tools, you need to swipe left again. And here it is. You can easily call this person or text and then swipe left once more and you'll see your tools. For example, compass. Or you can tap on three dots and switch to flashlight like that. Or you can choose ruler, for example. Here you can change centimeters to inches. You can calibrate it and so on. So that's it how you can use your edge panels on the Samsung Galaxy S25. And if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like and comment. And I wish you all the best. Bye bye.